now, Cap Cave View First Alert Weather with Jason Valentine. Good Thursday evening, everyone. Hope you've had a wonderful day today. Well, we're staying warm, but that isn't the story of the day. The story of the day is all of the winds we have out there, and they're going to continue through tomorrow night. Look at this, 38 mile per hour sustained winds in the Pendleton area, and very heavy winds throughout, 32 in Toppenish. Let's take a quick look at our wind advisory. So we, this will end tomorrow night at 9 o'clock, and we could be seeing up to 50 to 55 mile per hour gusts. They've just raised that up. So very windy conditions overnight tonight into tomorrow. So again, just get ready for that. And here are the gusts. 53 mile per hour gusts in Pendleton, 39 for Walla Walla and Tri-Cities. 49 in Hermiston. So the mid Columbia is kind of the zone. Also 41 mile per hour gusts in Yakima. So folks batten down the hatches. This will continue and it could get a little bit worse tomorrow, at least uh, at least speed wise. So as we look at also the mountainous regions late tonight into Friday night, we ex actually it's going on right now. Uh, so it's ending tomorrow night for the Cascades above 2000 feet. 12 inches to 42 inches possible, 5 to 2 inches for the Blue Mountain region. They will end on Saturday. And again, that could mean some peripheral shower activity for all of our cities. We just could see a little bit breakthrough. We already saw a little bit in the Tri-Cities. So a pretty unstable weather pattern right now with all of this wind. Let's take a look at the future cast and look at the mountains with the snow just sticking around until Saturday morning. And things are going to settle down a bit as we head into our weekend. We do have a chance of seeing maybe a shower early Sunday, but that's not looking likely. So overnight tonight, again, we have a bit of a chance of seeing a little bit of overnight showers, just like we saw last night. Overnight lows, though, above the freezing level, so very warm, and they will continue to be that way into tomorrow with those warm temperatures continuing for your Friday. And again, a chance of seeing a little bit of rain snow mix early, just like we saw this morning. But again, these temperatures are staying warm, and they're going to into March, which starts on Monday. My goodness. So we're going to be in those lower 50s to upper 40s for the week ahead, maybe even getting a little warmer in our next work week. Plenty of sunshine on the way. We'll have lighter winds for your weekend, so we just got to get to Friday evening. In Yakima, looking very nice as well. Upper 40s, lower 50s, overnight lows bouncing around the freezing mark. So again, these winds with gusts possible up to 55 will continue until tomorrow night and plenty of snow in the mountains. Be careful if you're driving over the pass.